I just paid $180 for this abandoned storage unit. I won it for the third time. Both of the first two times I won, the old owner paid up before I got here. So this time, I was waiting in the parking lot when I went off. I went in the office. I paid. Two minutes later, they call it, try to pay for it. This is the fun part. They can't get the door open. That's as far as the door goes right there all we can see is a nike box i'm hoping these black bags maybe have more shoe boxes in them little did we know we were about to uncover one of our top three storage units in over six years of buying them so make sure you watch this video from beginning to end because it's unreal you got a plan of attack <laughs> um <laughs> well yeah that uh, you're just gonna have to try to see what you can push back or pull out okay i can try to pull up this okay okay let's see Hold on. that might help okay. let's see uh, come on, you. Come on, uh, come on. Oh, okay, I got something out. Something's playing. Whatever this is, it's coming slowly but surely. Uh, come on. Uh, uh, okay. okay, we got something out. I got Woo! something out. I got First one bag. thing out. And we have first mystery bag. Ooh. A Care Bear, hey. still in the box actually. The box has seen better days, but the Care Bear itself is in pretty good shape. What else is buried in here? This looks like all kid stuff, doesn't it? I'm seeing some yeah. Barbies, Brats, I think. Toys, toys, is that a tablet? Is this a diary? No, I don't know what it is, but little kid's book. Uh, let's see, random, random. Ooh, a Microsoft Surface pen, pencil. These are like 40 or 50 bucks if it's in there, so sounds like it is too. That's a good find. This is a Michael Jackson book. Man, there's just a lot of like random little cheapo you know kids toys is this a what i think it is just the hot cross buns machine Quarter? that is a recorder hey. right there <laughs> and then yeah the rest of it i think is more so just those kind of toys okay i think i just got ultimately trolled i was pulling this out right and like you see the red and i was like oh it's actually in there and i open it up that is a crayola colored pencil <laughs> i don't think that's worth 40 dollars anymore <laughs> i don't think it is let's get this over here i want to get this shoe box out what is this a gun Looks like a freaking Nerf gun or something. Ugh, come on, you. All right, let's see. Well, these are all, those are all might be shoe boxes. Those are boxes? Feels like it. Let's see, can this one come out? Ugh, there we hey. go. There we go. Let's get this out. There we go. Hey, a bag. Come on, this is what I saw. They looked like shoes. It looked like shoes in the bag, and I think that might be what we have here. Charlotte, Roos. Oh, these are new, aren't oh, they? Oh, they're new. Oh like my gosh. Color. Huh? I like that color. It's like Tiffany blue, like a jewelry cool. brand Tiffany. Cool. Yay, that's brand good sign. New. This is what I was hoping for when I saw this unit. Brand spanking, uh, maybe worn once actually. But still, very nice condition. Here's Nike right here. There's Jordan in here too. Oh yeah. Let's go. Yay. Let's go. These down here, BCB generation, are these new? Oh, they look new too, don't they? Oh yeah. Oh my God. Brand spanking new. <laughs> Ah, I said this two months ago when I first saw this unit come up. I was like, it looks like it's all brand new stuff in here. These are size eight and a half, Vapor Max. Oh, these are $200 shoes if they're in there. These will pay for the unit. Oh, nah, they're used, but not too bad. That's just dry dirt. Look at the yeah. side. No, That's clean. really clean. This will come off really easy with the white. For sure. These still have $200 price tags on them. Let's freaking go, baby. Let's freaking go. Now we know why they wanted it. Five youth Jordan, so smaller. Ooh, but, ooh, nice. Gosh, these are so nice. These are my size. I'd rock them. A little bit of um peeling here, unfortunately. Yeah, still but nice. Yeah, still really nice. Still really nice. Do they have a price <laughs> tag on them? Not anymore, but they're kids, so they're not going to be as expensive. Another box of Jordans. Ooh, five youth as well. Let's see. Ooh, those are nice too. These are nice. These are what, fives? Right? Yeah. Boom. Super clean. This is exactly what my hope was when I bought this unit, but I didn't know if it would actually come out to fruition. I think I can get this one out. Now there's another bag on top oh of Oh my God, another And bag. another one here. <laughs> <laughs> and we don't even know like if this whole thing. I know. Full. Uggs. Ugg box. $180 we paid for this so far. That's crazy. This is why you buy blind. Oh, red Uggs. Red. red I've Uggs. never seen red. But Pretty look at the clean. bottom. They're clean. Yeah. They might be new maybe worn maybe once but really clean uggs are i mean a hundred plus dollars all day did they have a price tag on them no but they're well over a hundred bucks vans are they new no they're not new actually shoes. those are kids shoes but they have been used they're still, still good condition, clean though. though yeah still really clean look at this <laughs> nice. look at this baby let's go charlotte roos those are new brand spanking new what about this brand what does this say destiny's loop collection Never heard of that one, but they're in there and they're super clean too. Let's see right here, Gate Robin. 
Those are, what are those? Those are dirty. Yeah. Those are dirty. Yeah. When you see the foot imprint. Yeah. <laughs> those are dirty. Nikes, pretty clean. Yeah, pretty pretty clean. freaking clean. The eBay prices were crazy, so I went to StockX, and the last pair of these have sold, sold for 155 bucks in this size. And what about this one? What are these? What's this? It doesn't say nothing, does it? What's this what say? Here? Creeper Velvet. That's what it says on the Fenty? side. Whoa, other Pumas. Oh. Not bad, not bad at all. This bag right here is what's stuck on the door. If I could figure out how to get this unattached, I think we can get the whole unit open pretty easily. But I can't like, stuck on. it's grabbing onto something. You see this? No, I can't see. It's grabbing on, there's a whole box in it. That, it's like ugh, stabbed straight in the middle. Let's just pull the shoes. Oh my God, Gucci. Oh. Hold on. Okay, first off, eight and a half. Nikes right there. The Gucci box. The Gucci box, $595. $595 for the Gucci. Mm. Uh oh. Oh, ah, they're used. But still, they're, we only paid $180 for this whole unit. Right. In the Gucci shoes right there. <laughs> Even pre owned, I bet you they're still at least a couple hundred bucks. Let's get them out the way. Ooh, a size 13. Oh, kids. kids. <laughs> I was about to say. Nice. Oh, clean though. Clean. These are all, oh my God. <laughs> look at this one five youth oh look at those oh <laughs> they just opened these are pumas so, okay so this one's the wrong shoe okay. first time that's happened so far though but these right here man these are my color combo right there if i could fit those i'd be rocking the crap out of those they're so nice let's put them over here look at the sold listings for this single pair of shoes and just remember we paid 180 bucks for this whole unit let's see how i get this stuff out the way come on what are these Ew, more see-through ones. <laughs> those. Oh, come on. Come on. This box right here is history. Let's just try this. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to rip the whole bag. Mm. Okay. This might allow us to get in there. What box did I destroy? Hopefully not nothing too expensive. Well, I didn't really have a choice. These only have a price tag on them. So. I don't even see a brand on them. Yeah, these might just be some cheapo ones. If I was going <laughs> to destroy any box, I'm glad it's that one. And then we got Charlotte Roos. They're in there. And one more in here. Ooh, those are crispy clean as well. Yeah, they are. Mia, M I A. Okay. Okay, but now can I get into the door? No, it's still stuck. Hey, hey, whoa! Oh my, oh my gosh. God. Look at all this bags. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Guys, it goes up. <laughs> oh it goes up way like far. Can we get it open? There we go. Is that a shoe box too? Yeah. Those are boxes. Oh Those are boxes. There's one mattress. That's okay. There's a box made. That's okay. Look at all these there potential boxes of pairs. shoes. There might be a hundred pairs in Holy. here. Holy. Okay. First off, Ooh, unicorn. Unicorn. Nice. But where do I even start? Just grab. Yeah, that that bag doesn't let's look like boxes. Here. So yeah, this one doesn't look like. It. Let's just see what's in here. Um. Let's see. Bags. Purses. It looks like it might be. Oh, this is gonna fall though. When I'm the second I move it. Nope. Okay. Let's see. Are these purses? Hat. No, a hat. But it might be some purses too. <laughs> oh, look at Naruto Hello Kitty. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Then we got, what is that? It's heavy though. Is there something in here? I didn't even think to check the Naruto one. How do I open this? Mm -hmm. I'll squeeze it. There you go. There Good job. Go. There we go. Nothing. It's but silicone. It's heavy though. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, that has stuff in it. Yeah, that's definitely a. Oh, ew. ew. I don't know if we want to go in there. Do I want to open what's in here? <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I kind of, I kind of have to. Dump I'm it gonna out. dump it out. Maybe, yeah, somewhere we're not standing Let's over here somewhere. Here. Sure. Yeah. Money. Money. Yay. A dollar. Hair. Yes, I got a dollar. <laughs> it's all worth it now. What's in there? Is that all money too? Come here. Come here. Oh, there's foreign money in here. Oh, cool. There's a Ooh. bunch of foreign money in here <laughs> and a bunch of, what are these all? Ding mm -hmm. ding rechargeable power cards. Oh, Dave, Dave and Buster. Buster's. Somebody had a Dave and Buster's addiction. Then the rest of it's all changed. There's probably like five cool. bucks in there and just changed. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm scared it's a pee bottle. Yeah, that's a little questionable a little right there. little there. But yeah, let's see. Other than that, I'm not seeing anything else. Well, let's dump the rest of it out. Put this aside first. What else? Anything else in here? No, not that I'm seeing. What about in the front? In the front, they're just gloves. That's that's suspect. Oh my god, is that a push pop? It is. That is old school nostalgic. Pop, I know right there. So let's finish going through here. We have some hats. The Richmond Braves little smiley hat here. Uh, hat, hat. A Louis V? <laughs> uh oh. I don't have a good ratio with these. I think my ratio is 
one real and about 300 fakes from storage units so sounds about right <laughs> i don't never have good you know hopes when i see them there's stuff in there yeah let's dump it out right here i don't want to reach my hand in it i'd rather dump it out uh kind of random kind of random but okay. it does have a heat stamp in there but they fake those too so we definitely have to get someone that knows what they're looking at to look at this nothing in the front put that aside let's see pink bag this got stuff in it too but just makeup you can see in that one unfortunately here another bag uh, got stuff again though what are these cards <clears throat> you know what's crazy this is the third card i've seen three completely different names that's just a little sketchy you know a little sketchy uh nothing else on there Ooh, black bag it's full too and all these bags have stuff in them doesn't that just seem like somebody that was snatching bags or something <laughs> thirsty a capri sun there's a capri sun here is another Dave and Buster. How many Dave and Buster's cards does one person have? I'm looking for other credit cards. Oh, it's full of cash <laughs> at the bottom. It's full of cash at the bottom. It's just changed, but I mean, it's a lot. Look in there. And the problem is a McDonald's barbecue soft busted in there. Ew. So it's going to be sticky change, but I'm going to put it in a jug. We'll so clean it. We'll get it out. Another Louis Vuitton and another coach. I'm going to, like I said, I'm just going to have to guess based on my one in 300 that they're probably fake. But we'll get somebody that knows what they're looking at to look for sure. Let's go here. Why am I still holding her card? <laughs> that. Then we have more hats. More hats. Richmond Breeze. What is this one right here? Uh, this is. Same oh. way. Push. Oh, yeah. What the heck is it? Candy? There's candy and some glitter. And I don't want to touch the glitter because once you touch it, it's with you for life. If you haven't left this video a thumbs up yet, make sure you do it right now. This could be like one of the best ever, especially for the price point. If they open this up, that would have been a three, four thousand dollar unit all day. Because you can see that they're shoe boxes. I said that in the car. I was like, they look like shoe boxes, but I didn't think it'd be this extent. You know, I was thinking maybe we'd have two bags of shoes down there. Not 20 bags <laughs> of shoes. Like, what the heck? Oh my gosh, let's open this one. <laughs> Jimmy Choo? Yo, yeah, these are real. These are about to get so expensive. I'm sitting down here. Ugh, that's a weird looking Ugg box. Oh, they're slides. That's why. Yeah. Ew. Okay. Ew. Okay. <laughs> Jimmy Choo. These are real. These are super expensive. I'm pretty sure. I don't know much about design. Oh my God. Jim and Marcus. That's an expensive brand too. Aren't Jimmy Choo? Am I thinking of something <laughs> else? I don't know. Oh, look. What? Other oh, seat. Neiman Marcus. How much did they pay for them right here? No, they definitely pay for them. Oh, here's the price. It doesn't tell me the price though, but that's the receipt right from the store. So they're definitely paid for. I wonder if I could take this back and go see. It just says oh, the it's size. A, it just says a gift? Yeah, it's a gift receipt. Uh, oh man. Yeah, these look designer. It's a gift wow. receipt with it. Holy that's crap nice. right now. Here are the most recent sold listings for women's shoes that are brand new in this brand. These prices are insane. I'm just in absolute disbelief right now. Absolute disbelief. You know what's sad? <laughs> it made me feel kind of bad because earlier, Broly, baby Broly had this little PT appointment and I didn't go because I wanted to go be here when this unit went off because I didn't want to give them a chance to pay it off again. And did we make the right choice? <laughs> yes, we did. Did we make the right nice. choice? Yep. Clean as can be. I'd say 100%. Oh, what size are these? This is crazy. This is just absolutely crazy. Look at this. This freaking, where do you get this many shoes from? Like, do you think they're like personal collection or boosters? The only reason yeah, I say that is because <laughs> I've seen, I mean, most of the sizes are similar, but there's also some like really weird sizes in there compared to the rest. It makes me think, mm, I don't know. Let's see, like 7C here, looking pretty good. Then we have, Charlotte Russe, boom, and there again. Like these are, this brand's not too expensive. They're 40 bucks, they have the price tag on them. So <clears throat> they're not too expensive, but it's the Nikes and the Jordan and the designer where the money's gonna be at. Look at those Air Max, nice. This is an insane, oh. Another Gucci box. <laughs> it has its price tag on it too. This one's $620 by the way. This is, you know what's crazy? Now that I finally feel one that I, I think is real, the difference between the box is so obvious now. Cause all, usually they're fake when you find them. But these, I think are real. Wow. Those, they've been worn, but not really. Not really at all. And it has the dust jacket and everything in there. Yeah, these, I mean, look at the tag there. For you guys that buy a designer, I'm not a designer person. I'm a Burlington Coat Factory kind of person. But. What is still, where's the price? Oh, right there. There's the whole tag on there. there you guys can be the judge of that. <clears throat> We're not going to sell them until I can 100% verify, but. Oh, not yeah. going to sell those, but we'll sell Nike's and Oh, yeah, look at that. 
This is just wild, man. Converse, wild. This ha I, I said 100 pair. Now, 100 pairs, I think that was being too conservative. I think we're well past that. Look at that. Those are nice. This is going to be one of the biggest scores of my life. <laughs> Boom. And look at that. Oh, those nice. are nice. Those are nice. My gosh, what a crazy unit. Let's pull out some more. Let's go for one up top, see if it's different. Oh, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. No, 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 no. You stay. Stay. Jordan Flight, right on top. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Let's see. Mm. Same sizes. These are four youth. Four and a half. Clean though. Really clean. Even the ones that are used. Oh, if these are real, these are freaking expensive. Balenciaga. Where's the price tags on these? $695. You I see that? Right here. You see that? Yep. $695. Let's see. The box is like, again, it just feels nice. Ew, those are $695. <laughs> I don't understand designer. I'm sorry, I just don't. I'm so not a clothes person. No offense to people that get them, do you whatever makes you happy, but I don't get it. Oh, okay. oh my gosh. <laughs> my gosh. Juicy Couture. This is light. Is this a purse or an empty? our first empty box? Look, what the heck? Let's see, or maybe slides. No. Empty. Well, you know, after all the designer and the Jordan and the Nike, if I was going to find one empty, I'll take Juicy Couture. Yeah. You know, I'll take Juicy Couture. Let's see what this is right here. What are these? Leaf. They're from Nordstrom. That's the only thing we see on them. They're definitely in there. L-E-I-T-H. Those are women's shoes. This is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. There's two more in here. Let's see what these are. Come here, come here, come here. What is this? This one feels like nothing. I think it's, it's that other empty box. brand. We found it earlier. I think it's an empty Destiny's box though. Lupe. Yeah. Yeah, empty box. But this one right here is not. So what has this got in there? Same thing? Yeah, same thing. Ooh, new. Uh, oh, in, in a big thing. Okay. Woo! Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I'm a cheese and smiling guy right now. Which box should I go for? Top one, top corner, middle. What are uh, you thinking? Middle. Middle? All right. Let's. I mean, I think I have an idea of what's going to be inside, but just in case. Oh, look at that. Nike. Mmm, beautiful. Jordans. All right here. These are the girls in Jordan 9. Oof, those look clean. I don't mm -hmm. know if these uh they're in the right boxes or not. We'd have to check those. But those were nine though. So. Okay. These bright look nice. like Patrick Star. <laughs> that UG again. Uggs slides. These have the price tag on them. They're 75 bucks for these slides. Okay. Let's see. More Nike down here. Again. Boom. Those look like um what football team is that? Gold and red. I mean 49ers. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That's what I was thinking. This right here, six youth. My gosh. Have you ever seen in your life a shoe storage unit this good for that price? You might have seen one better that goes for you know, a few thousand, but for 180, I don't think it exists. I don't think it exists. Can't beat it. Puma, boom, right there. And then this one, what is this? This Destiny Lupe thing again. I never heard of that brand, but those are in there and clean as well. Well, let's see. So besides all the shoe bags, there are some more boxes back here, but I'm going to keep pulling out shoe bags. <laughs> all right. Because this is where the money's at. Oh my gosh, it's heavy. Jordan right on top. Jordan right on top. Let's see. Jordans, boom. Nice. And in there. How many pairs do you think we have? I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, just right here. It's well over 100, yeah, I think. Yeah, five at least in each bag. Ooh, burp, sorry. See those Uggs? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At least. What are these? And that's being conservative. Yeah, these are uh, and way. But oh, it's got a pair of double pair in there. Okay. A little bonus. <laughs> Penguins are a bonus. And then look, oh, good, look at this. If this box, right, if that was visible, this would have been a $700 unit. That's it. Just this. Yeah. $700 unit. Boom. In there and clean. The van's freaking in there. Decently clean. And then Nikes. Oh. Ooh, those are pretty clean. Mm. A little bit of dirt on the sides. Not too bad at all. And then we have, ooh, come here, come here. Ooh, nice. those are nice actually. Yeah. Those are clean, clean. They don't, those are, I think are new. Some of these, like some of them are new. I've only seen one pair that's like really dirty and those were like a random brand too, so. 
But those are probably the worst Jordans I've seen and they're pretty clean too. If you're wondering how and where we're gonna be selling all these shoes, we're gonna be doing them all live on Whatnot, guys. And we're gonna be having a show on Tuesday, literally two days from now, where we're gonna start almost all these shoes at $1 auctions, $1 starts. I don't care if it's a $200 pair of Jordans, they're starting at a dollar. Those Gucci and all the other ones come back authentic, I'm starting them at a dollar and I'm crazy. So let's go through this bag really quick before I tell you a little bit more. Check it out, boom, Nike's right there. So if you wanna download whatnot, make sure you use our link on screen right now because if you use that link to sign up for the first time, you get a free $15 credit towards your first purchase. So why would you not want the free $15? Jordan, still in the box. So use that link, click it, sign up, and then download the app, log in using the information you just created, and then look us up. Our username is at THWGBish. You'll find us. We have a pretty good show coming on Tuesday. It's gonna be a little shoey. Look at those Uggs. <laughs> little shoey. <laughs> and it's gonna be crazy. So make sure you do it. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. And if you already have an account, bookmark the show. This is what we're gonna do. If we can get that show 500 bookmarks before showtime, we'll give a pair of the Jordans away for free. Free Jordans giveaway if we can get the show to 500 bookmarks before there. So go bookmark that sucker for us, guys. Come on. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bang, oh, look are, at that. Those are like maybe worn once. They're so <laughs> clean, my gosh. This is why we buy storage units. For all the mouse crap and all that, that's, that's one thing, but it's every now and then you pay $180 blind and you get $10,000, $15, I don't even know how many thousand dollars in shoes. A lot, thousands and thousands of dollars in shoes for less than 200 bucks. This is why we do it, right here. Uh, this is why we, I came to the parking lot and I waited <laughs> and walked in as the auction was ending so they did not have a chance to pay for this again. Uggs, pretty much brand new I think in the box. This is just crazy guys. Charlotte Roos, boom. And then, oh my gosh, look in here. Oh, this box feels fancy. It just got that texture to it. What is it? Cape, Cape Robin. Robin, never heard of that, have you? No. Thanks. Okay. Yeah, not they a fan. They each their own. Not a fan. Do they have a price tag on them? <laughs> no, but that's what they do look like, though. That's what's on the side of the box right there, so. Box feels fancy. We'll see. Adidas. Boom. Clean. We just sold a pair. It looked just like this, like, maybe a week, couple weeks ago. And then, Nike. Oh! Nice. That's a better. I'll, I'll always take that. If it says Nike and it's actually Jordans, that's okay. That's okay. This is just wild. Uggs, again. Boom, more slides. Another pair of this one. These ones are pink though. They got like every freaking color combination. And the Nikes right here. They're popular right now. Okay. Boom, in there. And let's see, these right here. Bang, Oh, Maybe <laughs> these Nike. Microphone just fell off. Now my audio sounds horrible, huh? <laughs> what I was saying before my microphone so <laughs> impolitely fell off is maybe these Nikes go in that Nike box that had the pair of Jordans and those Jordans actually go in this box. Are those Air Jordan 11s? Is that what was in there? Might be. Might be. I don't know, but we'll do all, all that checking once we get it all home. This bag, oh, looks like it's full of plushy type things. Yeah. Squishmallows? Squishmallows? Squishmallows are money. That's what it is. Yeah. Is that what it is? Well, it looks like it. I don't know what a squish. Yeah, it says it on the tag actually. Squishmallow. Hey. It's a big one too. They're not like really expensive. Like this is probably 20 bucks, but. Collectible though. Yeah, definitely collectible. And yeah, this thing all the way down is just full of plushies and toys like that. So we'll go through them and make sure there's nothing else that's uh, worth selling in there. I'm just sitting here taking this moment in because I've been doing this for six years and I've never had a moment like this quite this good. I've had good units, but I pay up for them. This good of a unit for $180, never, never, ever, ever. And I mean, we bought well over five, 600 units. I don't know, probably a thousand by now. Very thankful for the door being closed. Yeah, I was so thankful for the door being closed. Cause if it wasn't, I said, this unit would've went for like five, six grand. I wouldn't have even considered it. I don't really mess with the shoe ones. Cause I swear like the shoe ones, people just pay retail. Like they really do. Look at that Charlie Roos right there. They pay retail prices. And it's just, I don't understand the logic. Boom, because you don't even know if they're in there. That one's kind of dirty. But still, it's just dirt on the outside. There's a difference between like ripped up and just dirt you can yeah. wipe off. Magic know? eraser will do wonders. Exactly. For Magic issues. eraser. Oh, those are still in the bags. Yeah. Magic eraser will do so much magic work on these. So easy. Last pair in this bag right here. Boom. These still have a $140 price tag on them right there. Still have the tag on them. Bang. That's exactly what they are, too. This is mind boggling. Oh, mind boggling, mind boggling. There's also some box, oh my gosh, that bag, you see that bag? 
That's got a bunch of loose Jordans in, and you can see Jordan sticking out the top. Yeah. <laughs> what the heck? This, if this is somebody's personal collection, why is it all in the unit? Makes me just think, I don't know. Part of me wants to say they're stolen. Part of me wants to say, most of them are the same size though. So if you like, were magically able to steal just your size, that's pretty impressive. <laughs> or maybe you sold off all the ones that weren't your size. Another mm -hmm. pair of Oak slides. Yeah. It's, I don't know. I don't have the answer. Look at that. If that was open in the picture, $1,000 unit all day. Yeah. $1,000 unit all day. Boom. Those are kind of cool. Yeah. Those are kind of cool. Tyree. Right here. Yeah. That's what the my new ones were I just got from another unit. Yep. Come here, come here. Ooh, get, open up. Nice as can be, nice as can be. The only downfall, which isn't really a downfall because we got it for 180, is that with the sizes being 5U, 6U, small, they're not gonna be nowhere near as expensive if they're like the bigger men's sizes. But still, with this, well, what we paid for it, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. No. It doesn't matter at all. You There's can't problems. lose. No, if they go for, Say super cheap in. Say if they sold for forty bucks a pair. There's hundred and fifty pairs. We paid two hundred bucks. That's like six thousand dollars. Even if they sold for twenty. If they sold. Yeah, look at that. Those are like the Valentine's Day. Ones. Yeah, these might be expensive. I don't know. I want to look into these really quick. There was a Valentine's Day special pair. I was just curious. I just looked that one pair up on eBay, and that one pair, even the small size, is like seventy bucks. So, I mean, it's just crazy. Absolutely crazy. This is why we do it. If you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, first of all. How dare you? You should consider yourself like, you know, in trouble. Two, just do it. These are just those. <laughs> those. Heels. Yeah. Women's shoes, I don't really have the most hope for. They don't usually Ew. do well for us. These are 35 bucks. I mean like dress shoes. Women's size itself, as long as they're like, you know, actual tennis shoes. Some Tims. That's new. We'll take some Tims too. Ooh, yep. Fresh and clean. These are like usually 150 bucks, sometimes 200, somewhere in that range. The knees, boom, look at them. Clean as can be. These, oh, oh, that looks like a Louis Vuitton box. It does. Ooh, those, okay. There. Those are the worst condition shoes I've seen yet. Yeah. Well, something else is in there. What is that? Just some crap, some paper and stuff. <laughs> Homework stuff? Yeah, some random stuff, like random, okay. But, but, hold on now. Hold on now. Oh, baby. Let's see. That's what we do it for. Oh, ooh. Okay, let me tell you. If this is real, I think it is. Mm -hmm. The only reason is just the feeling. This versus that one I just touched. You feel that? Yeah. Look at that velvet inside. I believe this one could be authentic. Let's see. There's our heat stamp. There should be, is there a serial number in Louis Vuitton? I told you before, I'm a Burlington Coat Factory kind of guy. I don't do designer, so I don't really know exactly what to look for. But let's see, let's shine in here. Uh, I don't see anything like that. But then again, I don't know where it would be or how it works or anything like that. But the fact it's in a box, that's a positive. There's they, a dust thing. Doesn't make it 100% though. They make no, big no. boxes all the time. But this one definitely feels way different. Like this feels like an expensive first. The other ones feel like fake ones so i think that could be real so we got it home did find the serial number it does check out online showed a few reputable people that i trust their opinions of and everyone thinks it's real so this is definitely a real louis vuitton bag the prices i see on ebay are anywhere from 300 to over a thousand so i don't know should i go for the loose bag or the this bag or the weird box in the go back? for the brown box we don't Let's know see what's, what's in that we don't know what's in these you know what these do have Shipping labels, okay. That's, I want this person's name. Cause I wanna see what they did, you know what I mean? So I looked the lady up, I found her social media profiles and it come to find out the lady who owned the unit, boyfriend or husband, I don't know if they're married, is a fairly well-known rapper. Not someone that I had heard of, but I started looking the name up and they have done shows with some pretty big names in the industry. I'm not gonna tell you their name because that's just kind of douchey. Explains where all the designer and shoes came from and all the money to buy all this came from. Is yeah. it possible that these are all stolen? This looks like mostly computer hardware, router, headphones. Ooh, look at that necklace. You see that? Yeah. Come here. You. Oh, oh. Let's see. That's got actually something on it, too. I can't read it. It's too small. I see. What? what? A bullet. Ooh, a bullet, too, huh? What size is that? 40 s and w Okay. Okay. Oh, there's more jewelry. I just set this somewhere. I don't know where. Come over here for a second. <laughs> I'm running out of spots. I kind of, I think you guys understand. I don't want to leave this stuff and go load up the truck because I don't want to leave it alone. Look at these earrings right here. I'm going to put these in my pocket too because they have this much designer and shoes. Good possibility they're gold too. 
uh, crayon. There's the, another bullet. A couple rounds of some gun. Other than that, looks like a Master Chief leg or something. Another bullet. It looks like mostly crap. This is a little box in there. I don't know if anything's under it. Let's see. No, the rest of it's just empty, but maybe there's a gun in there too. I guess. Let's go to another. Oh my gosh, the weight, man. The weight. This is just so freaking crazy right now. I'm just so overhyped. These are little ones right here, but. 12 C. Oh, they're a little dirty, but again, it's just that surface stuff. These will come off really easy. These look like all more kids, so here. But still, super clean. Boom. Super clean. Boom. Get off my leg. Super clean. Not a super clean, but still, again, surface. It'll come off easy. Look at this. My gosh. Oh, those are probably the worst condition ones. And here are the receipts. As you can see, they paid 135 actually, I actually can't show you because that's part of their card number on it. $135, November 15, 2014. Still has the receipt in there. And then, boom, all white. Oh my gosh, guys. What are these? Oof. Oh my goodness. And the Converse, boom. My God. I don't know what else to say. Like, I feel like I'm, no, I I'm just like completely lost for words right now. Like, this is once in a lifetime unit right now. I was just telling her off camera. For now on, you already know any unit online where the store is stuck closed is going to be gone for like $3,000 once this video goes public. Mm -hmm. I already know it, but it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, they're not all going to end like this. Probably one in a thousand are going to end like this. Mm -hmm. Superstars. Oh my Jordan's gosh, Adidas. The Jordans, I know. Let's see, Adidas, Con oh Yeezys. Yeezy 350s, how much do they pay for these? 140, kid size, that's why. But, they didn't even really make kids Yeezys. <laughs> but there they are. I saw Kanye on the side. New Balance, clean, and, oh. <laughs> let's end with the Gucci box. No way, kid $265, kids Gucci's, kid Gucci's. Uh, they're used, but not the tops look pretty freaking clean. That is beautiful. My heart rate's even higher. You know why? Why? I saw the shipping box. I was like, what's in there? You see what that says? FN Herstal. If you don't know what that company makes, you pull the trigger and they go boom. <laughs> Man, Are we going that is that? not an empty box. If that's in there, you know we're gonna have to test it out too. Just saying, we're gonna have to test it out. Oh my God. This unit here is one time ever this will never happen again never never and i'm well aware of it and i'm just enjoying the <laughs> ride i'm just enjoying the ride boom brand new jordan absolutely enjoying the ride and boom black and blue jordans my gosh guys boom this is just what do i even say i don't know what do i even say at this point i don't know it's like i don't just, know what to say just show them off <laughs> i'm just lost for words i'm lost for words i really am this is just i don't believe it still i'm looking at it i'm unboxing it i'm the one in the video i don't believe it still <laughs> i still don't believe it i'm the one doing this is crazy absolutely crazy superstar like my gosh absolutely crazy Whew. This is, oh, oh. Thank you, storage gods. <laughs> Thank you, storage gods. Let's see. Boom. Those are weird looking, but okay. They're in there. These right here. Ugh. Boom. I'm sorry, that's confused. I was looking down. Look, they put a Jordan sticker on top of the Jordan logo. I was like, wait a second. That looks a little <laughs> sus. But no, it's on there. And is there any more in there? There's one more. One more. Come here, you. Boom. Mmm. Mm -hmm. That box is not empty. I cannot wait to get it. Oh, what the heck is this? The heavy? Oh my god, yeah, this weighs like a million pounds. What that, is this? Isn't that a shoe box? I thought. Oh, oh well. Boo. It was bound to come eventually. Yeah, what is your profit loss stick? What do you do? Uh I oh an eyelash company. Ooh, okay. They made pretty good money. They made pretty good money. I'm looking at their 2020 tax form. I'm kind of a stalkerish. That their um, gross income was four hundred fifty-four thousand dollars. I don't know how much of that's profit, but that's pretty good. It's crazy when you see people go from like making you know almost half a million dollars to you can't pay for a unit in years, like two years. I don't know what these are. These are all medical papers and stuff in here. This looks like personal stuff that. Yeah, I don't want to look through. Let's see what's in this one. Are those VHSs. Uh, 
Ooh, those Blu-ray or PS4? Oh, Blu-ray. Let's set them down over here. Um, these are all discs. NOS. Uh, uh, what are these all? These are all just CDs. Yeah. Looks like somebody's actual CD though, because it's like they're yeah. all the same. This is some dude's mixtape. Yep. There's like 40 of them. We're about to have to go play it. Let's see in here. Put it in like the intro music. I know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, nah, that's just, these are just random VHSs. Random DVDs and a few Blu-rays. No video games or anything like that. The first box I see in here is a Gucci box. Do I go through here? Or should I just take this out and look? Uh, wait on wait. that. Yeah. Uh, I'm, wait. She said it, not me. Practice I would have went through it. Patience. I would have went through it. Uh, oh my gosh, why is it so stretchy? Alright. Even though you're like seven months younger than me, you're still a young one. Practice <laughs> patience, young one. Three hundred ten dollars <laughs> on the Gucci shoes. Mm, in there. Pretty clean. Let's see, let's see. Jordan, clean. Jordan, clean. Jordan, clean. Oh my gosh. Uh, One shoe. Scammed. I'm returning the Boo. unit. I'm returning the unit. <laughs> I just got scammed. Air Force One. I, I approve. I'm yep. wearing them right now. <laughs> As Nelly said though, we need two per, not one. <laughs> There's another one right there. Uh, let's see. Let's go two at a time. Boom, Jordans. And boom, Jordans. Oh my gosh, guys. This is a once in a lifetime. Mm, and I'm really just, I, I, I'm trying to film the video, but at the same time, I'm trying to just take it in. This is that thrill that you don't get to experience very often in this business. The good thing is, is that we do make videos and you can just Ooh, watch it back. That's probably the worst conditioned pair I've seen so far. But yeah, I've watched some of the old videos back, but it's still not the same, obviously, as being there in a the moment. But this is that dopamine rush that we live for. But you get to capture Airs, this moment. We do. And exactly how you felt. And more, ooh, those are kind of dirty too. But, okay, you know what? I'm growing impatient. Okay. I'm gonna get the big box. Okay. I just wanna know. Let's I do have it. To know. Let's do it. Oh, At least you empty. waited one more box. It's definitely not empty. Ooh. Uh oh. Can you uh, get the big box? I'm trying. There we go. What is it? Keep going. Pull it. I can't. All right, there we go. Does it say what it is on any side? No. It's upside yeah. down. Oh, okay. FN America. Oh, no what? way. What? 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 Scar. If that is in there, do you know how many thousands of dollars that's worth? Oh my god. You gotta lay it down. Pay for it? <sighs> lay down. Heart rate. Oh Heart rate. Heart rate. What's in here? Oh my gosh. Come on. No. 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 Dang it. What are these? 30. Uh, there's the mag for it. Ah, uh, trigger guard. Dang it. You know what? There's still more space in the back of the unit. I'm not done yet. Look at this. This oh, is what I call insanity. These look bigger. Not too much bigger. They're What's, probably like five youth. Five youth? Uh, these are five youth. That's pretty good. So look at that. How many pairs do you think are in there? 15? Yeah, probably 15, 20. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy. Like a right $400 bag? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this. Oh, there's there it is. There's my scar. <laughs> See? It's all right here. This is what we came for. Ah, there it is. Okay. <laughs> oh, that uh, Fortnite sniper rifle. But yeah, the rest of this in here is just uh, plushies and kid stuff and things like that. So bring that over here. What's in here? Oh, big box here. Let's see for a second. Oh, what is that? First off, some pictures. I'll we'll make sure we leave behind graduation yeah this is all personal stuff that i'll make sure they get back family portraits graduation stuff trophies yeah this is the leave behind kind of box here before i looked in this last bag i wanted to use it as a table to go through some of these first what the heck is this these are all the same thing what the heck bottles just bottles different yeah. color bottles okay i wonder what is this Okay, flower petal. That, that's good. You said she had a business though, right? Yeah, that's what it said on there. They could package like perfume or something. Maybe she made her own perfume or something. Yeah, that's possible. Or that's oils. Possible. There. What do you think's in the cooler though? The cooler. No! <gasps> Yu-Gi-Oh cards? Yu-Gi-Oh cards? What? What? I see. Are there any first editions in here? These are old. 1996. 
There's a Dark Hole first edition. There's first edition Yu-Gi-Oh cards in here. And there could very easily be a freaking um, Blue Eyes White Dragon or a Dark Magician or one of those. A lot of the conditions um pretty rough though, like this cartoon monster. Yeah. But still, still, still definitely something we gotta look through because the right ones could be worth some money for sure. That's crazy. That's so <laughs> random. So right? random. So random. Here's some uh, decor, just home decor, yard sale type stuff. What is this? Ooh, I like the size of this. Let's see. Ah, infinity TV cable box. No fun there. This one, oh, that's heavy. What is this? Mystery blue box, huh? All right. What is this? It's tax time. This is like just some company BS that they hand you to go hand out to people and stuff like this, door to door type stuff. Just their certificate of like doing it. Yeah, this certificate is presented to owner's name in recognition of their efforts and achievement at completing the eight week tax course. Ah, so it's like a door to door tax company that they work for too. And the rest of it, just, you know, stuff the company would give you. This one says glass bottle out little on this size, so I'm guessing it's more, yeah, more of those. What do they pay for all those? Only 54 bucks. I thought they'd be more expensive than that. <laughs> hmm, that's a lot of them now. I mean, maybe we could sell them like this too, because obviously they were shipped like this, so we'll see, we'll see. Put that here, and then we got this big guy. Oh, it's heavy. The Re Reflection Filter X. Is that what's in? No, that's why. It's papers, it looks like. Let's see. Papers, paper, nice tiger. Ooh, see some of this music stuff could be, what is this first off? Auto-tune, we have $100 auto-tune, <laughs> yes. Nice. Now I can become a mainstream rapper. Whoa, this microphone's got a $200 price tag on it. This is this is how he recorded that uh, mixtape we found. Yeah. Is this new? Is Hold it? on. No, I don't think so. But it's a $200 microphone if it's in here. Let's see if it's in there. Come here. Ooh, nice, nice box. packaging. Yeah, nice packaging. And the mic is, nah, not in there, unfortunately. Blue. But there is that piece. This guy right here, this looks like a, I don't even know what they're called. Uh, C control is what it says on there. Control room matrix, Samson. At least we can see what that is, obviously. And this here, oh, that is really heavy. And M audio M track plus. Is that what's in there? It's really heavy. I feel like it might not be, unless that thing just weighs that much. This is, oh, hey, is that our microphone? What does this say on it? CC12? Like it. No, it's a different kind of microphone, but there is a microphone. And there is, um, is this part of the audio? It looks like an interface of some sort for yeah. audio stuff. So definitely something I'll get Brandon to look at. He knows about all this music stuff and so we'll be able to see what it is. Let's open up the last bag and then we're gonna see what's in the final box in the corner. But the last box in the corner just feels like it might have something hidden in it, you know? Steve Madden, bang, basically new. Fuzzy what? Those are fuzzy shoes. Charlotte Bruce. Oh my gosh, I see a box in here with a $650 price tag on it. Is that more Gucci? Yep. Gucci, yep, $650 right there. For that? Is that really what they are? <laughs> what does it say? It says plastic upper, rubber shawl, sparklet. I don't know, are these actually Gucci? Does it say Gucci on them somewhere? Yeah, it does. Yeah, on the bottom. Yeah, look, it says it on the back too. Mm. Well. I'll be, man. If it's got the name attached to it, people will buy it. I don't get it. It's kind of like the Apple marketing strategy. Like, you don't even have to make a good product. You just put your logo on it and people buy it. This one right here, Nike Air Force Ones. Ooh, some color combos on them. And then we got, oh, this one's heavy. What is this box here? This has a $580 price tag on it. Alexander McQueen. Let's see. Ooh, okay. Okay. Okay, yeah, five hundred and eighty dollar price tag on those. It's like dipping dots, huh? <laughs> it's like dipping dots. Yeah, the knees right here look super nice too. They don't have a price tag on them, but the box—you can just tell like the designer boxes versus the normal Nike ones. Are, these are used. They're pretty beat. <laughs> the bottoms are at least so those. And then we got what is this last pair here? Jordans. Ooh. Those black and nice. yellow, black and yellow. Hey, you know what it is. <laughs> so let's go. Oh, see what this last box is. Oh gosh, it's heavy. What is this? Oh come on. This is what we change. This is what we save the last box for. Oh, those are gift bags. These are all gift bags. You know what? <laughs> Every pair of shoes I ship, I'll give you a gift bag. No, I'm lying. I'm gonna use this packing material. But could the scar be hidden behind the mattresses? That's the question. Anything? No, but you know what? Feel the mattress. I'm gonna shred these <laughs> things. Like usually I'll just throw mattresses away, but not this time. 
I'm gonna take this thing apart and I'm gonna shred it and I'm gonna make sure there's nothing in there. What about the box spring? Anything? No. Ugh. No, there's nothing in the corner. I'm like looking up in the ceiling and everything. Man, all right. Let's load it up and get out of here. We found a stack of these concert posters and it didn't take me long to realize the guy on the poster with Shy Glizzy was actually the same guy that was in the ladies profile pictures on Facebook and I realized that was her boyfriend slash husband. I don't know if they're married. So this guy has literally performed with the rapper Shy Glizzy. If you don't know anything about rap, this guy's got some pretty huge songs. I mean, I'm looking on his YouTube channel. I see 58 million views, 27 million, 13 million, lots of multi-million views. And now that we have them all laid out, this is what 100 $80 storage unit looks like. I don't think it's possible to get a better unit for a better price than what we have right here. Definitely a once in a lifetime legendary find, guys. One of the most insane storage units ever, but we didn't find the gun. If you want to see one where we did find the gun, click this video out. We might have blew some stuff up. And if you just like seeing more shoes and you want to see a safe that was locked, we broke open, found weapons, click this video over here. And until next time, peace out.